my show is to promote local small businesses and leaders who are making a remarkable difference during COVID-19. You can watch Lead the Way on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. All links are down below. Subscribe, turn on notifications, and lead the way. Let's get started. Today, I am honored to interview Grandmaster Park of the Parks Taekwondo Foundation. Let's get started. Let me start this interview by sharing the remarkable story of Grandmaster Park and his father of how they made this foundation. Grandmaster Jung So Park story begins in South Korea where he grew up and studied Taekwondo. He had the honor to train under his sensei, General Choi, a man who then became the president of the International Taekwondo Federation. After serving in the Navy, he made a trip all by himself to America in hopes of opening his own Taekwondo school. The family struggled when they first moved in and they lived in the Taekwondo school making ends meet. Grandmaster Park moved to Florida and this is where him and his family made the Parks Taekwondo School. What makes Parks Taekwondo so special is the family history and the family business passed from father to son. The most important teachings I've learned from Parks Taekwondo is that the mothers are the most important and that the creed of courtesy, modesty, integrity, perseverance, self-control, and indomitable spirit, which I apply daily in my life. Grandmaster Park is not just the owner of this family business, but he's also a seven degree black belt in Taekwondo. How can people learn more about joining Parks Taekwondo? Well, it's very easy. Of course, you know, look us up on parksfederation.com and we do have multiple locations. We are the South Florida's largest Taekwondo martial arts organization from Pembroke Pines to Plantation to Coral Springs, Coconut Creek, Boca Raton, Lake Worth, so you can look us up and also now we're on the World Wide Web, virtually, okay? So we're offering virtual classes for the community. Matter of fact, anybody can take two free weeks live virtual classes. Um, just look us up on Facebook, okay? Parks Taekwondo and message us and we'll be happy to give you the link so that way your child can stay active and Check out Taekwondo and see what it's all about and see how it can really help your family like it's done for the cow. Thank you. I am honored to have trained at Parks Taekwondo in Boca Raton for four years and have earned my first degree black belt. I also have the honor to represent Parks Taekwondo in the Taekwondo US Open in 2018, where I won three gold medals and three silver medals. Grandmaster Park, these days, a lot of people are worried, depressed, and scared about coronavirus. They are worried about their jobs, their economy, their health, and their future. You and your family had ups and downs. What message do you have for people that are worried and scared during coronavirus? Well, um, you know, this pandemic has really turned our entire world upside down. And I think it is truly really um, sad us what happened. But here at Parks Taekwondo, we believe in the yin-yang philosophy, which is you know, part of our you know, logo at Parks Taekwondo. The yin-yang represents the, the both equalities. I think through this pandemic, we become stronger, mentally, physically, emotionally. And I think we have become more human and so much spiritual and psychological strength that we develop from it. But at the same time, it has affected our entire country. 
especially economically. And a lot of families are struggling. So it's times like this, it's important to have a positive attitude, positive mindset. And being positive, it is a real thing because it is an energy that we create within ourselves that exudes and transcend to others. So one of the ways to stay strong is to have a positive mind and also be an example, especially for mom and dads that are really going through this pandemic and, and struggling their work virtually and, and, their, and the kids also attending school virtually have to be not only working, they also have to be teaching for the student. It's, it's stressful. And on top of that, the family responsibilities that we have as parents, you know, they didn't go away. But the tenacity, grit, and being relentless is the most powerful example that we can show to our children. And I think that is a valuable lesson that we learn from this event, which is something that we can pass on to our children. And this is something they can look back and they were part of this historical event, even though it wasn't the best thing that we wanted to, but it can be a very positive lesson learned from everything that's happened through this you know, virus. Thank you. While many coaching and training businesses are down, leaving their students behind, you and your team have been doing virtual lessons. Tell us more about that. Well, you know, one of the most important things is um, here at Parks, you know, if you, if you look at the window, it says, you know, persevere and never quit. One of, the, one of the things my father taught me is exactly that. He's always taught me to persevere. As Mikel said earlier, I mean, we immigrated to this country, went through a lot of tough times, even living in the martial arts school. So one of the things that I've really learned from my father was the indomitable spirit. And that's exactly the core way of operating our schools from a business point of view. When this happened, we didn't think twice, like, we have to continue what we are teaching, especially my father's legacy, which is something very, very important to me. So going virtual was something that was just nature. We had to do that. We had to continue to make sure our students progress with their goals. We also had to make sure they are continually receiving the benefits of their training and also not stop their journey of becoming a black belt one day, which is a core philosophy and our goal of our program here at Parks Taekwondo. Thank you. I learned a lot about hard work at the Parks Taekwondo. What message do you have for kids that are stuck at home and how can they stay active? Well, one of the ways to stay active is to, remember, you can go outside. We're not allowed to go outside, okay? We can play in our driveway, we can play in our backyards. There are many, many resources out there and games that they can play that keeps them physically active. But more importantly, remember, you're spending time with family. So cherish that, value that. And because this is something that you will not do forever. Because even Mikkel, you're gonna grow up one day, you're gonna become an adult, you're not gonna be with mom and dad for a long time. Mm -hmm. So boys and girls, cherish this time. Make sure you help with everything. Make mom and dad lives easier and let them know how much you love them through positive action, good behavior, and get along with your sisters and brothers, okay? What are your plans to reopen and how can people learn more about joining Parks Taekwondo? Reopening is something that we are anxiously waiting for our local city government and state government to um, open. And we have to do it in a very careful phase because number one priority here at Parks is safety, okay? And safety is very, very important. And we're going to be, of course, opening under strict guidelines of our government, of CDC, and also um, just, just, dude, we just gotta come back and you know, power forward. Yes. Come here. So in creed position. Okay, let's do the creed. I will live my life with honesty and integrity. I will be polite and loyal to my family and instructors. I will use my skills for defense only and never bully. I will show compassion to all living things. I will show courage and fight for justice. I will never give up. Black Belt Creed! As a dedicated student of Taekwondo, I shall 
Live by the principles of the Black Belt Creed, courtesy, modesty, integrity, perseverance, self-control, and indomitable spirit. Taekwondo. Taekwondo. Say no. Come there. I'm a little rusty, but can I try some Taekwondo moves? Of course, of course. You're still a black belt, even though you haven't trained in a while. You're still, it's like riding a bicycle. Pam, it'll come back to you, snap. Okay, what do you want to do? Let me see. Go ahead and do it in the air. Boom, okay, all right, instant roundhouse kick, okay? Guarding stance. Ready, go, hitch! And let me see, spin kick. Oops. Oh, yes. Spin. Good. Get faster. Turn your body fast. Go. Turn your body fast. Go. Good. Are you ready? And go. Pitch. Good. And then, then jump to the front kick. Go ahead. Let me see. In the air. Pow. Right. Okay. Nice and high. Ready? Target set. First, key up lock before you go. Key up before you go. Key up the front. You understand? Yeah. Thank you, Grandmaster Park, for your time. Guys, we should support leaders, small businesses, and frontline workers in our community who are making a difference during COVID-19. Website for Parks Taekwondo are all down below. Facebook, everything is all down below. Mika out.